Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. Back in the late 1970s and early 80s, I loved watching Happy Days, and while I didn't catch the first few seasons when they originally aired on TV, I would fall in love with those early episodes later on when I would catch them in reruns. Now as the show progressed from season to season, something I started wondering was, whatever happened to the Cunningham's oldest son, Chuck? You see, long before Happy Days became the Fonzie Show, and yes, even before Joni loved Chachi, Happy Days was, at its heart, a show about an American family. And the Cunningham family had three children, Joni, Richie, and the oldest sibling, Charles, Chuck Cunningham. Now, Chuck was part of the Cunningham family for the first two seasons, appearing in nine episodes in season one, and then just a few in season two. After that, it's almost like he never existed. The Cunninghams never reference him, and in one of their later episodes, Howard Cunningham even states that they had two children. What? What happened to Chuck? Chuck was played by two different actors throughout his existence on the show. Gavin O'Hurley, who played him during the first season, and Randolph Roberts, who plays him for a couple of episodes in season two. The character of Chuck really had very few speaking parts. And at one point, around the middle of the second season, Chuck was said to have gone to college. Now, according to Gavin O'Hurley, he, he hung around for the first half season, then asked out of the contract. It wasn't his cup of tea, and it raised some eyebrows, but he said he was glad he did it. Now, as I've said before, Chuck would show up again a couple of times in season two, played by Randolph Roberts, and then he was never spoken of again. Well... Once Gavin O'Hurley had made up his mind to leave Happy Days, he did manage to stay quite busy picking up parts in TV shows and movies from 1974 all the way through 2009. Out of all of those roles though, probably my favorite is his portrayal of Eric in the Ron Howard directed fantasy film Willow. Willow was such a fun film when it was released in 1988 and I thought it was cool to see Gavin O'Hurley and Ron Howard working together again. Now on a side note, I'm really excited to see the new Willow series set to launch on Disney Plus in November. It's too bad that neither Gavin O'Hurley or Val Kilmer will be in this new production because both were so great in the first film. It is really clear, however, that O'Hurley loved being an actor. Here's a picture of O'Hurley as Brad in Superman 3. O'Hurley had been working on a film titled Queen of the Redwood Mountains in 2019. That film has not yet been released and is currently listed as being in post-production. Unfortunately, Gavin O'Hurley passed away in November of 2021 at the age of 70. Henry Winkler, who played the Fonz on Happy Days upon learning of O'Hurley's passing, would tweet out, Gavin, rest in peace. It was a pleasure sharing the screen with you. You walked up the longest staircase this time. And Ron Howard would add, rest in peace, Gavin. I knew him as the first of two Chucks on Happy Days, and then as Eric in Willow where I had the pleasure of directing him, a talented actor with a big free spirit. Now these are fantastic compliments. Here's where I want to hear from you. Do you remember Gavin O'Hurley as the first of the two Chucks on Happy Days? And if not, what is your memory of Mr. O'Hurley? One last thing, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel where I talk about the movies, TV shows, and music that I listened to while growing up in the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Well, as always, thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there, and have a great day.